friends, the proof of God's amazing love is this, that while we are sinners, Christ died for us. And so as we believe in him, we can have faith and we approach God in confidence. So let us now turn and confess our sins before God and one another, first in a time of silence and then together with a prayer printed in our bulletin. Let us pray. Eternally loving God, through the saving death and glorious resurrection of your Son, our Savior Jesus Christ, we have been set free from sin and death. And yet we confess that we remain captive to doubt and fear. We are bound by the life-denying ways of the world. We overlook the poor and hungry and pass by those who mourn. We are deaf to the cries of the oppressed and indifferent to calls for peace. We despise the weak and abuse the earth you made. Forgive us, Lord. Help us to trust your power to change our lives and make us new. By your spirit, encourage us to share the joy of life abundant. We have come to know in Jesus Christ, our risen Lord. Amen. Friends, God's love is abundant in our lives. And in the waters of our baptism, we have been redeemed and sealed into the promise of this love. In Christ, we are made new. The new life has begun and the old life has gone away. So know that you are forgiven and be at peace. Amen. Now, as recipients of this divine and loving peace of Christ, let us now turn to our neighbors and extend signs of this peace. And the peace of Christ be with you.